things. <laughs> okay, I, I I started it, but okay, I I started it, but okay, okay, I should be alive again. I have a lot of text. I've been forgetting to te check the chat. Uh. So, uh, hello, bear. Are you? Is he still here? Oh, well, I'll get I'm about to go out to play. So people don't get bored. <laughs> okay. Yeah. When I start streaming properly, I think I should probably get. Two monitors, because uh, it's a bit awkward checking the chat with one monitor. Oh, that's pretty cool. Someone wants me to restart this uh, this map um, because because my streams dropped out. Just let me know in the chat, and I'll do that. If I can just check the chat. Okay, there's nothing. nothing there. right. Yeah, so I'm currently on map five. to the industry. Blimey, it is. This map is a titan of an industry. <laughs> There's just so much, like, so much layers. Layers of floors on top of each other. It is deserving of its title. Ow! Excuse me, do you mind? Zero out of ten. Cannot dual wield axes. What a what a bad one, hey.
Let's go. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I thought I could catch a ride, but sadly not. I can catch a ride, it's not the way I expect it. Ow, ow, oh dear. I'm glad I chose to run to this side. If I went to the other side, I'd have a zombie shooting me and he would have died. My dog file. Thank you. Uh, I own five hit points. That means four hit four hit points I don't need. <laughs> yeah, I really love the moving runway. That is pretty good. Pretty awesome. Pretty, uh, what, what other words? Fantastic! Another thing I love doing <laughs> is just zooming <laughs> across it. Because I can't do it to normal walls. health. So I'm going to have to play very well to not die. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> not like that. Okay. She does not use the flames for her. I feel like I'm not supposed to have it. That's what we're talking about. I see you, Revenant.
turns out you can just uh, stun lock them. It doesn't quite. You can't quite. Oh, okay, you can't. Yeah, you can wall run. Come on, wall. Pronounce your W. Is it? Come on, Zadunk. Yes, come on, Zadunk. Pronounce your good letters clearly. frozen for long periods of time. Is it is it good now? I mean sometimes I have to tab out to uh, look at the chat, but I don't spend that long reading it. That is a shame. It's a bit frustrating. But it... We just finished this fight now.
Okay. Uh. She's the rockets. I'm getting hit by fireballs that I can't see because the caca is floating above my head. So perhaps. Oh, okay, this is going to be really annoying to kill. down here. Just don't be a wuss. There we go. Okay. Alright. Uh, I'll try and disconnect the internet and reconnect it and maybe that'll fix the problem. It's working again. <laughs> Oh no, no, we don't wanna we don't wanna hear hear my echoes. Okay. Uh, is it working now? <sighs> Why can't my internet connection ever be good? Like, in the last three homes I've lived in, you know, it's university, my internet just goes randomly. And it's just, it's just kind of annoying.
But I can just chat to you, I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why I'm uh, studying. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Glenn. That, that helps. Oh, no. Um, there we go. I can live with only 21% health. Just the railings I can warm up. No, I can warm up. What do we got here? Oh, hello, Scrang. Hmm. I'm playing uh, <laughs> Heartland. <laughs> I see. I hear this is the best Doom mod ever made. <laughs> I'm sure. Did Glenn tell you that? <laughs> <laughs> there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of portal usage, which gives uh, quite a quite a good 3D feel, like. I've heard. Uh, yeah. That is the main appeal to Eternity in a lot of ways, is the, the portal system. Yeah. It's my first time playing Eternity, so... Nice. Streaming in 1080p? Uh, what do I look like, a rich man? <laughs> <laughs> I, I'm, just, I'm just using the default settings, man. <laughs> <laughs> I can watch a good three seconds and then it buffers. Oh dear. <laughs> See okay. the thing is, the thing is, um Twitch like only gives you the uh the what is it, the um the uh oh, what's the word for it? Not buffering, but the um it'll re re encoding. It'll re encode it'll give you options to re encode stuff at a lower bit rate, but only if you have enough viewers for a certain amount of time. Otherwise, It'll just give you put output the source quality. So like me, I live in basically the boonies. So I don't got that great a connection. So uh, I see. a lot of like, yeah, a lot of like low um, viewer streamers who try to like check them out. And then I just can't watch it because they're streaming in like 720p, 60 or 1080p. And I'm like, oh, I tried. I tried, man. <laughs> oh, dear. Uh... Do you know if there's a way I can lower the source policy? Or do you think that will help? I mean, you can do it in uh, OBS, right? You're using OBS? Yeah, I'm using OBS. Yeah, the only thing is, I don't know if you could change the bitrate uh, midstream, is the thing. Oh, uh, I see. It would be in the output settings, it would be like under streaming, and you can rescale it. Um, oh, it'll be something to look at forward to in a second. It'll, the VOD will be fine. The VOD will be, like, beautiful quality, and it'll be easier <laughs> to watch than, like, the, uh, the main thing. So I could just use, I could just, you could describe to me what is happening, like, use my imagination. Uh, okay. I, um, I have 1% HP. <laughs> Which is, I don't need any more than that. Uh, I am very low on ammo, and there's a dark file being annoying. Oh, uh, right. two oh that's a we got like a weird gun there. It looks like a got flamethrower. It looks like the it looks like a zombie plasma rifle. Is the only thing I could describe it as. <laughs> that is true. It looks like it's mummified, like all shriveled up, like a King Tut or something. 
Ramsey's a second. <laughs> yeah, it just it just had that sort of like uh, tan yellowy look. I don't know how to describe it. Oh, this is what I need. Oh, this is a lifesaver. Alright. I will say I do like the um, the grass texture. I've been given the opportunity to appreciate in uh, full detail here. Yeah. Can't, it's quite like quite nice how they like, played that to the uh, rock texture. Mm. Oh yeah, doesn't it? Like a smooth transition. It's interesting. I'm just gonna resurrect lots of monsters, I'm not gonna have the ammo to kill them. Oh, you get Uzis? Yeah, yeah. I remember hearing about that. We had double Uzis. <laughs> See, this is like. Stuff like this is what we've been missing out on by people not, like, making anything really for, like, more advanced ports. I mean, so many boom authors, I imagine if they just did a little bit, we could get, like, some really nice playing and creative maps. Yeah. It being Skillsaw doesn't help. I've heard a lot of good things about Skillsaw. I've never actually played any, though. I'll try playing I'll A play and I'll try playing A and Bed Vendetta once, but I... Uh, I mean, I, I can't, like... Mm. I got a bit too tired in the middle, so I wasn't, I wasn't a big fan of it. I like, I like, like, I found the first few levels in Data to be really good, but then I didn't really like the later ones, so I stopped playing. What map set was that? Uh, a Alien Vendetta. Although it wasn't, oh, all, it wasn't all skill saw. There was some, there was like one other map, but I think. Hmm. I didn't know he made Alien Vendetta. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he did. Uh. I'll look it up on the wiki. <laughs> yeah, that's wiki. What, org. That's what I'm gonna do. I don't want to spread New disinformation. Wiki. Org. Oh. <laughs> uh. let's, let's check our citations here. Um, Skill saw. And no. Uh, Paul. No, it was Ancient Aliens. Oh, it was ancient aliens. That's that's ancient oh. aliens. Ancient okay, because I was thinking like I was thinking like I, I was thinking so like sorry. alien vendetta. You've been around that long. I was like, damn. No, no, I was talking about ancient was like, aliens. Oh, I can't believe I got these two confused. Okay. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't finish ancient aliens either. I got like part way th through. I got to like the. I want to describe it visually because I don't remember which number it was and what name it was, but. No, that was BTSX. No, 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 no. <laughs> BTSX was the one with the water tunnels and the lights. Um, right, Ancient Aliens. I got to the um. I got to the map after the one that falls down. The one that with all the lowering sections. I think that's like the third map. I don't remember. I get tired playing games. Like I'll play like forty minutes and I'm like, whew, I've been playing forever. And then I'll look at yeah. the clock and I'm like, oh. Okay. I... I don't know, it's, sometimes it's true, I think that's true for me with like, slaughter maps. But there's some like, there's some like very addictive games where I'll play it and then like, and then I like, like, it feels like I blink and then it's like 10 hours later. <laughs> I guess it just depends on the mood, because I know I played uh, the Resident Evil 2 remake when that came out for a long time. 
Like, I was, like, hooked on that, because I just like the... I guess because it's the tension of it. Like, it's not very fast-paced, so it's not, like, physically exhausting, but, like, there's a lot of tension, so it keeps you interested. Oh, uh, yeah. At least for me. I don't know, that's good. I've, I watched a uh, playthrough of, it, of it, Resident Evil. It looks pretty fun. More f yeah, it's more fun to play than watch, which is saying a lot. Oh, wow. Circles. Oh, there we go. All right. There we go. Is it still like uh, buffering? Um. Let's see. Oh, you're streaming in 1080p 62! <laughs> wow! Oh, I yeah, have. Because I'm just using the default OBS setting. You know what? Maybe I will change that on the source. Maybe that will Oh! Fix it. I bet OBS was like. OBS was like. Okay. Because it probably did that automatic setup at first, right? Yeah. So the OBS is like, oh, this guy's got a great internet! And they just set you to max quality. <laughs> okay. Video bitrate is. 6,000 kilobytes per second. Is that a lot? That's a know. lot. <laughs> Should I turn it down? Uh, yeah, I 6,000. 6, I think you're recommended not to go above 3,000. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't know. Why did it put you at 6,000? Uh, maybe I'll try 2,000. That That'll well. do. All right. Let me know if it gets better, <laughs> or if it gets worse. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Well, it's certainly uh, grainier. <laughs> okay. <laughs> hmm. Wow, it's a lot grainier. I mean, it's, I can see it now, at least. I can see movement. Okay, is it? Still buffering, though. Is it still like maybe? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> because this is probably like the first time Glenn's heard me like not falling asleep. <laughs> and also, I just got off a call with other people, so I'm all I'm all energetic. Ah, uh, nice. Yeah. Uh, oh, it's got the smooth animations too. Oh, well, I actually never noticed that. Huh. Got like kind of a uh, fancy. I like this. It's cool that it has its own little touches like that. But how will people play with gameplay mods? I wonder if that. I don't know. I don't know what the conflicts are in that kind of thing. I'm not as familiar with Eternity. I don't know. Um, I'll do it. Okay. Yeah, that animation is really smooth. I just—I never noticed. He pointed it out. Crazy. Ow! That was very rude. Oh! Feel like. Oh, I know that I mean. Feel like that was violating social distancing measures. If I'm going to be honest. I'm not sure I can <laughs> really approve of this. The flash effect on the rocket explosions really reminds me of like a Sega Genesis game. 
Like something you'd see in like a arcade, like shoot him up or something. Like the way it just has that white flash and then the explosion. Uh, I have never played any shoot up games. <laughs> Pretty much when you know like two things. Oh, you got raided. Oh. By Francis218 with a party of five. How do you feel about that? Right, who's this? There's a party going on. <laughs> are you gonna are you gonna do a celebratory dance? <laughs> right now, man, get on <laughs> start break dancing. Only five. Oh, well, you got a beggars can't be choosers, I guess. I think there's an arc file in this box. <laughs> what was it? Never look a gift horse in their mouth. Why did they say that? I do not know. <laughs> Why you look? Maybe there's some sort of medical thing where you look in the horse to see how healthy it is. It's like, well, you shouldn't do that. It'd be like if someone, I guess it'd be like if someone, let me, let me mangle this, this, um, this metaphor <laughs> by bringing it into modern day. Um, it'd be like if someone bought you something and then you immediately went to check for the reviews on like Amazon or whatever. <laughs> for like, if someone bought you, <laughs> you know, it's like, don't do that, man. Uh, map one. Going so well until those remnants came in. Okay, just for time. Do the flames like attach to monsters, then burn them over time? I don't know. <laughs> That'd be interesting. Oh, that's cool. And they burn you too. Interesting. Yeah, the flames hurt you. You don't want to use it. It's really weird because it's like it doesn't have much range. But you don't want to use it. So you, so you can't use it at long range, but then you can't like use it. Yeah. At and you don't. Range either. And you don't want to get too close. Yeah. We got all the DVK. Do we? <laughs> There's someone in the chat. We'll have Billy. Uh, oh, we've got Francis128. Oh, I see. I was raided. <laughs> I can't believe it took me so long to realize after we had this, after we had this whole conversation. <laughs> oh, dear. Surprised he managed to find me, to be honest. Uh, oh, sorry. Yeah, I have to tab out every time I want to share the ta ta <laughs> chat messages, so if I like randomly pause for a few seconds, that's what I'm doing. Okay, is my, is my stream still going? Because you've been quiet for a while, Scrang, and I wonder. Just, like, yeah, it's still cool. going. Okay. I was just like, I. I like, um, I muted myself to cough or clear my throat, and then I forgot to unmute myself. Ah. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I know the feeling. Happens to me too. <laughs> yeah, so I've been, uh, oh, I've been like. Yeah, um, I think. I don't know if, I don't think you can change the stream resolution while you're streaming which um which leads to like this blockiness like but in the future you might want to put it down to 720p okay um 1280 by 720 you can reskill rescale the um there's like settings for that and uh oops 
Sorry about that. That's <laughs> fine. <laughs> I just had an oops. <laughs> <laughs> I'd have not rated. So no, no, no. Everyone is. Everyone's here. Shit. We all. Everyone needs friends, right? Everyone needs like. I don't know. <laughs> all right. It's not a DBK exclusive stream. Don't worry about it, Francis. Uh, it's just as. <laughs> I was like, I wasn't stream. aware it was one. I, <laughs> I just came in here because it seemed funny. Yeah. I just like to come in and like I. <laughs> it just bother people on the stream. Not mean. Not mean. I'm never mean. Uh, I am. I'm proud of it. <laughs> I'm very mean. I am very mean. Let's see. Scring is a gentleman. I don't know about that. You see, I, I have this. I'm I this, about that. I have this. Ta I employ this uh, strategy called uh, tactical niceness. So I'm nice, 99% nice of the time to get people's guard down. So when I'm mean, I completely shatter them. So you see. I only heard tactical masonists. Like, you put down, like, bricks and, like, four <laughs> tiles. <laughs> oh, the gentlemanly British manner. I'm, like, way too casual with swearing. Kind of a problem. I use it as a filler whenever I do. <laughs> yeah. I already swear I'm really angry. But the problem is, is that like... <laughs> I don't swear when I'm angry though. Whenever I'm angry, I usually just use like very like stupid words. I call <laughs> I call people like... Fro like frog humans. <laughs> shit. It's just like, that's what you are. You're just a disgusting amphibious <laughs> creature walking out of a fucking Del Toro movie. <laughs> I have not ever been called a frog human before. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, man. Take a risk. Oh, there you go. Don't hit me with the frog human. It's not a. It's not a, like a bludgeoning weapon. I don't like fucking dual wield them. <laughs> oh, this is cool. Oh, look at that tower. I bet you can go up there. Uh, talking about the gray, the gray towers. Um, it's the weird uh, ringed. Looks like this bridge going to it. I mean this thing. But oh, that one. Yeah, I think so. <laughs> Seeker around here. Yeah, twelve HP is not a good place to be. In. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna use the shotgun. I have loads of shotgun shells. Oh, let me load up the Prima Guide for this map. Look behind some of the big crates. Okay, let's go find it. Uh, big crates. That's a big crate. There's no, there's no such things behind it though, because it's like in the middle. This one. Got any ideas, Scrang? Um, well, let me, let me, let me, uh, <laughs> wait for the stream. <laughs> um, okay, so we're in a industrial okay. facility. And, uh, we got a. Oh, have that's to, a cool effect. I think I have to go up first. Yeah, I'm not gonna be much help if I'm getting distracted by, like, pretty lights on the walls. <laughs> yeah. Aesthetics completely Left fly over my head here. sometimes. Ah, there. Whoop. Oh, that didn't work. Okay, I have to, have to go back up again. And do a, a strafe jumping. You know, it's a common, common physical law. You know, three, 
three three sides of a triangle, C equals A plus A plus B. A squared plus B squared equals C squared. I failed algebra and I still but, somehow know I'm that. I'm saying, I'm saying. No, 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 <laughs> see, see, see. No, 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 no. Look, clearly, clearly, clearly C equals A plus B because look, 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 look. look if I go, if I go forward and I go right, you see my, my, uh, the vectors added together, you see? C equals A plus B. But that's how, that's how the world works, right? Oh, I see. <laughs> See, I can I can prove it to you. See, see, this is so this is like forwards like the A and left is like the B. And I go and if I go and if I go uh, forward and left, it's A plus B, which which must be C, right? Yeah. I'm not any good at math. <laughs> Okay, um, let me try and do a straight jump. Okay, well, like... Maybe that's not the right crate. What is Ben saying? I'll jump behind where you're jumping. <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! Uh, oh, there! That's a very I'll sneaky secret. I, right, thanks. Because the thing is, this is built like a, um... This is built like a uh, like a normal like Doom map set you would see like on Boom or whatever, but it just uses the features to make more map set basically. Yeah, it, it's it uses them to to help the level design, which is something I've always wanted out of these. Like, it's just like the features are there, man. People can use them if they want. And here it is. Now, now I see why this is getting so much like praise because it's like. Finally, <laughs> the, <laughs> yeah. the advanced source ports get their meat. It's like this is this is real shit. <laughs> yeah, I haven't quite seen like a 3D effect like 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 this map before. Billy has been recovering. Die already! More oh, meat, less mods. Yeah, and even like map sets like Lullab like Lullaby, I wasn't too big on because a lot of the level design was like room, room room with like fancy architecture and then yeah. like kind of like uh here's some pinkies here's some shotgun here's some bunch of zombie men and like it reached a point where i'm like i'm like so this, some of these enemy layouts don't make sense because i walk into a room and there's like a bunch of like um like hell knights or barons put there like i'm supposed to be afraid of the barons <laughs> and it's like, no, those, those zombie men are, like, more dangerous than these barons. And it's like, <laughs> this is the trap? <laughs> and it's like... And then, like, stuff like, it introduced pain elementals and arch files in a trap, which is... Ouch. I mean... Yeah, that's that one... That, that was the most interesting layout, like, in terms of combat and stuff. It was a cave area. Um, my only thing was... The visuals seem to be a lot more basic there because it didn't have like the complex, um, like architecture, like real world ish architecture to rely on. Um, so it just kind of became like, like a cave with glowies. Um, I like how I'm reviewing a completely different WUD uh, while, while looking at this one. But um, another thing was there's another room where it was like mostly pinkies and imps. A lot of revenants in that level. There's a lot, a lot of revenants. Um, and pain elementals. The problem with pain elementals is if you can get close to them, they break. They break. <laughs> they, <laughs> so, yeah, it's just like. Yeah, it's like. Visually, very complex. I'm, it's not, I'm not a fan of like the dark like level design with the bright visuals. But you have to admit. Very complex, 
A lot of work went into that. Sells the whole voidy aesthetic, does that right. Um, but layout wise, combat wise, I wasn't feeling it. Feeling this. <laughs> I'm feeling this. Yeah, it's very. That shit right there, you fucking drop through the floor right into like a fucking barren pen. <laughs> That's the shit. That's the shit you should be doing. And there's like rocket guys above you, yeah. <laughs> That was a very scary I... moment for me. Oh. I smell a trap. What do you think, chat? There's always a trap. Alright. Hmm. <laughs> Just assume it's always a trap. <laughs> no way to never go wrong. Oh, I'm back to the beginning. Oh, shit. I mean, people don't know it's the beginning because my stream I... cut out. <laughs> but this is, this is the beginning. <laughs> All right. Okay. Actually, no trap. Yeah, there's no trap. This is what is this? I was promised a trap. I feel like this is fraudulent design, making me think there is a trap, but there's no trap. I never claimed to be an expert. <laughs> or right. Map chops. Oh, the exit. Uh. I hope this is the beginning of something. I hope we get a new era of shit like this. <laughs> Where it's like, it's just like, yep. Alright, here's some new mechanics. Here's like some cool level design, makes like intelligent use of the features. Um, and here you go. Yeah. Maybe bridge people like too long for too like you know too long. Shit's been like kind of, I guess I don't want to say segregated, but like it's like, um, where it's like you either make a boom map set, or. You go to ZZ Doom, and uh, you go into that like niche or whatever, where it's like it's like two different camps. There's not like a lot of people like learning from each other between the two. I don't think a little bit with Eve Eternity and like Dragonfly, I think was the first. Um, I don't know. <laughs> right? Am I yeah, right on that? I was really stayed up to date with the. Uh... Oh, oh there, okay. Okay. I've, I've been, uh... I guess my sources have been cited. That was a hard act to follow. What's going to say? <laughs> I would have made I would have made a bit where I'm like, yeah, but I don't know, I'm pretty good, but nah, not even I would. <laughs> not even as a joke, I'm just like, yeah, looking at this. Is that thing, but nothing else comes to Yeah. Nothing comes to marriage. Yeah, make sure to save afterwards. <laughs> there you go. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. 
When it dropped, I played it immediately and lost the world map. And it was like nothing will be as perfect as this ever again. Damn. Luckily for everyone else, no one has to be perfect. <laughs> we could just make any old shit we want. <laughs> and it'll be fun. I have never played Valiant before. <laughs> I feel like I accidentally <laughs> I feel like I accidentally played violence instead. <laughs> How many Doom cause there's violence, there's Valiant. Is there another one with a V in the title? I guess like Eve Eternity. Vanguard. Viagra. <laughs> I don't know about that one. Actually, is there one called that? Shit. Anyone want to steal that? <laughs> Wait, is that is that map called Vanguard? There's oh, only so we there's one it. for us. <laughs> Next map set is just called that. <laughs> Hasn't taken this guy. I mean, I can understand a map, but a map set like a megawatt. I don't think so. I don't think so. At least nothing like super notable. I don't think. Thank God for the Doom Wiki. I could just be lazy and never have to know. Nope. Nope. There's results. There are no results matching the query of Viagra on the Doom Wiki. Alright. Alright. Hmm. Oh, damn. It's more incredibly big in the later maps. Set it should be a set of levels if it's more incredibly big. Oh, lots of sector penises. No, it wouldn't be penises. It'd just be like, like Freudian symbolism, just like phallic symbols and shit. Or <laughs> like the map is just like a lot of tall um, structures and shit. A lot of like skyscrapers and um, just like subtle psychological shit. And it's just like, yep. And <laughs> when it's become X rated. I don't know. Maybe I've been a negative influence. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> Tall and hard tower maps. Jesus Christ. Um, I imagine like, how big can you? I I know there's like an upper like limit, where like after you make a map that size, things get like screwy. I think the only, um, I think it's only like the Zudium Community Project, one of those maps is like one of the few. God, that was like early days, wasn't it? That was like forever. Entire wad of innuendo. Sea World show where a dolphin named Dong jumps into a oh, yeah. Man. Bugs, it's nice. Bug would be secondary effects. That's a side effect. Call your doctor for any erection that causes block map errors. Christ. Zedong. I thought I lived that down, but it's come back. That nickname. 
Isn't there a guy actually called Mao Zedong? Wasn't yeah. he like a like a Chinese dickhead? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I didn't know that. And ben had to tell me that. <laughs> 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 have no time for sent. You just have like a censored version of like the fucking texture pack that people could make maps with it for it work or whatever. <laughs> or you just replace it with like, I don't know, oil paintings of like fruit. Doesn't matter what it was, it's just like, it could be a monster. It's whatever, it's just a painting now. Big painting. Whole fruit. They just wear trench coats. <laughs> uh oh. Now we're really going places. That'd be so... That'd be a lot of work, though. Because you need to, like, make, like, a normal version of the one. And then you'd have to make, like, the fucked up one. <laughs> that'd be a lot of work. I remember Glenn telling me about that, like, um, that orange armor pickup and how it worked. Oh, yeah. I remember being, I remember being really fascinated by it. I'm like, oh, we should steal that. <laughs> <laughs> but it's good for if, like, you're like, hmm, I don't really want to give him full armor or, like, you know. It's not going to be hard to figure out what to put, like, in a secret or just in a side area. Yeah. Feel this wide. <laughs> I made this. You made this. I made this. <laughs> uh, too bad. Okay. Another, another stupid mod idea I had was like, just like Plutonia sixty-seven. <laughs> right. Just be like. Yeah, here's my sequel to Plutonia, and then it's just like, Doom Guy goes to the jungle and fights like Tiki's or whatever. <laughs> Even though those are like Tiki's are like fucking Polynesian. Oh. He goes to like he goes to the Amazon. <laughs> the Lady Fighter sequel, 63 and a half. I mean, it'd be a great topic for web series or blog where it's just like, I do have a lot of really, really fucking stupid mod ideas. I just forget about them over the years. The only reason why um, I remember Plutonia 67 was because I found like the fucking project folder where I just made the, the sky texture. And it was just like a jungle, and I was like, oh, okay, I remember this piece of shit that I never <laughs> did anything with. It's better than no, be better than no mod ideas. <laughs> <laughs> better than no ideas and making nothing. <laughs> yeah. Terrible ideas and almost making something a little bit. <laughs> Next we'll make like a mod that's just like 
Yeah, it's just everything is one pixel. <laughs> Every enemy is just a page, just a pixel. You have to guess what monster it is by like the color and the way it oscillates. <laughs> Plutonia 69. That's, I mean, hey, that's a sequel to that though. At least it's not much work in the graphics department. <laughs> no, we without that you'd you'd finish that uh that asset set pretty quickly. <laughs> Tony of thirteen thirty seven. Can this just be? Can it just every everyone makes their own Plutonia, right? Everyone, every Doom modder in the world can make their own Plutonia, right? They just have to pick a unique number, and um, they have to like continue the Plutonia like story, <laughs> whatever whatever that is. Him guy goes to a new jungle, this time full of like rainbows and peat moss. Plutonia four twenty. I mean, it's obvious what kind of jungle that would be. It's a massive block, but extremely well animated. <laughs> Every human being. So you'd end up in the future, you'd end up in like the hundreds, probably. What do you make? No, we can't do That's cheating. Negative numbers. That's crazy. That's theoretical stuff. You can't have negative apples. But you can have imaginary apples. So we should that is true. Imaginary numbers. <laughs> Plutonia is real, okay? Plutonia is real <laughs> in here. Yeah. You need a flamethrower weapon in that so, one. <laughs> I have this new mod, and it's called Plutonia I. And, like, there is, there is no map set. You just have to, like, imagine it yourself. <laughs> <laughs> you make your own map set. <laughs> you like draw pictures on the ground. <laughs> and it's like, there you go, let's make your own Plutonia. Plutonia Third Eye. That would be like DMT. I guess that would just be ancient aliens. Some guy goes to like the forest and drinks like a. It's an ayahuasca? No, that's, a, that's the cactus, isn't it? I don't know. <laughs> I forget. I think there's ayahuasca, and then I think there's another. There's like two. I don't remember actually. There's the vine, and then there's the cactus. Santo de me. Oh, I heard a cyber demon. The first cyber demon of the world. Mescaline comes from the cactus. Okay. I only have shells. Ask Iowa. Yeah, like that shit is heavily affected by like, um, like have, uh, state of mind and like, myself into you can have like head. you can, people have like ego death on that shit. Scary. I don't know. I wouldn't really do any like psychoactive because like I I I get told enough that I seem oh, like man. I'm high, constantly. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I, mean, <laughs> I think I'm going to yeah, have to go from here. I'm gonna, no, I'm... Uh oh. Oh, well, at least I Shit have... spot to save. Yeah. Very good sigil. No doom to demons. I guess everyone's got to do that at some point. I'd like to have more monsters, not less. <clears throat> it's just Okay.
that for Zeta Man. Demon Inspectors. The SSG is an interesting weapon because it's really easy to over rely on it, but it's not necessarily the best. I don't know. I guess it's like a kind of a, a weird way. It's like a mental, it's like a mental trap weapon. <laughs> you can get stuck using it, but it's like, nah, maybe the rocket launcher would be better here because of the rate of fire. Yeah. Rocket launcher is like a really good chance you can kill yourself. <laughs> Yeah, but if you're like firing into like a, a group of like popcorn men or um Yeah. Like you gotta kill something tough really fast, like the fire rate makes it the better option usually. What's the other thing is that I also get lots of shells, so I have to uh, just use the shotgun. No oh, yeah. Um refuse to draw portal. Well I hope that doesn't come to fight me later. Moving away from SSG replacement. Yeah. Um. Because it's like, it's weird because the plasma rifle gets held off a lot like it's an upper class weapon. Which it really is a good panic weapon. It really is a good panic weapon. The thing is, um. Given tough enough opposition, it can also serve as like, kind of like a meat and potatoes like main part of your arsenal. refuse to drop portal. <laughs> it's just like, nah, I don't want to. Is that what the message said? Refuse to drop portal? <laughs> That's awesome. I love yeah. that. It's just like, nah. <laughs> I asked to I asked to draw a retweet. I asked to draw a routine today, and he said, nah, I don't feel like it. So it's no portals for you, I guess. I Sorry. I really hope the map doesn't break <laughs> because of that. <laughs> Just like, especially because it's like the the. Especially because it's the second time doing it. It's like it. a, <laughs> yeah. it's like a committee, like the fucking um, the fucking source port is just a committee of all the different like, like routines. Like you got the drawer, you got like the fucking sound backend, you've got like the compiler for like the fucking scripts, and like just one day like the fucking drawer is just like, no, nah, I don't feel like making any more portals, you know. No. I died shortly thereafter. Oh, I thought the message killed you. Never mind. Interpreted that wrong. Oh. And it just fell down and cr like sawed Doom Guy's arm off. Just descended from the top of the screen, just like sh 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 back and forth. I really wish I could comment more on like the map set, but itself, but not having played it and also having a little trouble seeing it. But that's oh, yeah. most likely my fault. <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what to say about this map set. It's got good verticality, um, it uses sector portals. Because Dan told me that, that's <laughs> how so I know. Um, um, oh, there was like this really awesome sequence at the beginning where, the, where you're like the moving train. I know I've seen that done before. Oh yeah, I heard about that. Like, basically, basically, there's like moving sectors, <laughs> and that's just like I, haven't, I just haven't seen that before. It's pretty cool. Yeah, I wonder if um, because I think you can. I think. Do you think it's because? I know you can do that in Jeezy Doom. It's not perfect, but you can apply a portal to a poly object, and I wonder if they did that here, and just Eternity likes oh. it a little bit better. Could, uh, yeah, um, yeah it's not 
perfect because you can't use. This, of course, I think you, oh, you can't use the static portals on that either. It has to be a two-sided uh, poly object. It can't be a one-sided line. And the the it's complicated. I think this came for eternity. Not not having worked in eternity, I don't know. The only time I worked in eternity was like very briefly when Sodaholic with the with when I briefly like work with him on the cat game um and that was an eternity yeah i think back then portals had a lot of hall of mirrors in eternity they weren't quite where they are now i don't think yeah uh dragonfly too dragonfly was involved on that for a bit um it didn't go very far because soda is he as batshit crazy as appears um, he wasn't hard to talk to. The thing is, he just talked a lot, and he had a lot of, like, out-there ideas. <laughs> he had a lot of out-there ideas in regards of what he could do um, in the engine. Like, he wanted to do, like, he wanted to do, like, reflections um, on the sprites by, um... Like sort of drawing like the sky texture over them, which would have does it sounds to someone who doesn't intimately know how all that shit works um, necessarily. It sounds plausible, but I even at the time I was like, all right, um, that'll be that'll be nice when it's done. It's yeah, but uh, the main th reason I didn't make a lot of, like, progress mapping for it is because, one, that was a long time ago, so I wasn't experienced, and two, he didn't have, like, a lot of direction. I didn't really know what he wanted. So that kind of fell apart. I completely forgot about that until just now. <laughs> I think he still have a few prototypes that he sent me. Um... <laughs> yeah, sorry. That's legit. <laughs> oh, yeah, two. This is. Yeah. Box of shotguns, two shells. Seems like a good trade. Isn't he called Blast Frog now? No, he changed his name. I don't know why. I guess because it's like he didn't want to be associated with that name, right? But it's like people know who he is. Yeah. Blast Frog. I don't know. It doesn't sound as cool. Sodaholic sounds like your fun. Sodaholic sounds like your fun buddy who like slings soda around. He's like, ha ha. Blast Frog sounds like a monster. Like he'll shoot you with like lasers or something. Or like acid. Is Blast Frog the guy you called a frog human? That's why he's uh <laughs> No, I didn't call him. This, this was before Frog Human. This is before I, I was awoken to justice and I learned to speak um, such words. <laughs> Bootleg Pokemon Blast Frog. I guess that is Blastoise, is it? No, Blast. Oh, he's a turtle. I'm thinking of the fucking um, Ivysaur or Venusaur, or whatever it is. That's the Blast Frog. Childhood Jazz Jackrabbit and Battletoads. At least they'd both be green, you know. It's like, I was like, what color? What? Uh, <laughs> we don't like the colors. Okay, it's not. Um, cooler than he is, at least. I mean, I don't want to speak bad to the guy. He hasn't really done anything bad to me. Um, I just know he played, like, Famiclones on YouTube. Like, he played, like, bootleg 7001, like, Mary Pizza Poppy, like, like, uh, flea market fucking Famicom bootlegs. I remember that. Well, I mean, I remember that? 
I think I remember his birthday thread. I don't remember. Depends on when that was. Yeah, like, well, see, the thing is, Action 52 was, like, original games they made for that. I'm talking about, like, the 7 billion and 1. Like, literally, some absurd high number, like 7,000 and 1. And then they just have, like, 72 versions of Mario, where, like, Mario is, like, a different color. He just copied again and again. I felt like he didn't hear the present. Yeah, I don't know. I don't mean it that way. I don't mean like, yeah, I don't know if he deserves... No, I mean just like, I don't know if he's like a bad dude. Never really interacting with him much. Or at least I don't remember. Looks over to Maximum Doom. Yeah, something like that. Something like that where it's like five, five trillion in one. And then it's just like they take Kung Fu and then they copy paste like a poorly drawn Mario head over it. And they call it like Mario 20. I can't think we used that birthday. That's funny. Uh, recycling. I mean, I could I could approve of like recycling old maps. It's like, should I do something with them? <laughs> Just not... they probably wouldn't even spell his name properly. That is, that is, yeah, that is true, but exact, you're actually right, because that's how we end up with shit like Mary Pizza Pop. And I can't, I don't know if I can leak images in chat, so it probably won't work, but like, Mary Pizza Pop is like this weird fucking bootleg, where it's like Mario, and he's got like no teeth, and he's got, he's like, there's a weird like fucking gremlin man. And he's like got his hand up and like a weird sea hail and he's just fucking horrible. I hate him. Um Can we post links in chat? I Oh I Yeah we can. Okay, there it is. That's Mary Pizza Pop. It's just like this disgusting baby blue cartridge with this grotesque like fucking Oh, he's horrible. I hate him. Ugh. Yeah. <laughs> I know. <laughs> but I didn't know. He's, he's a monster. He's like some, um, he'd be like an, um, fucking... He looks like a Disney, like, gremlin. Like, he'd be like some gross... He reminds me of the, um, fucking, I guess spoilers for Snow White. But when the, the queen eats the juice and she turns into old. But he's like he's like a horrible man. Like if Mario ate the ugly juice, uh, they done with you, Luigi. Super Maru. I think it's like Estonian or something where like Maru means epic. I don't remember. I think like. PC is Estonian for Goblin. Princess Bride Inigo Montoya. Princess Bride. Um, oh, um, fucking Andre the Giant? No, 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 this isn't Andre's character, this is the other guy, never mind. I saw that film once a long time ago. Memories are the best. <laughs> this is him. This is him if he never found, um, never avenged his father. He just became a horrible pizza monster. Oh. oh, my first bag. 